Oh yeah. How you kill them like that? Just Straight shot them. in. Yeah. During the morning, so. So we are in luck. There is a big buck buck grub sitting in that pot. So it's good to know that my massive big fish head did do the work, but there's definitely been more crabs and a rat chewing on my bait. So, uh, well, I got one. That's good enough. So that is what all the efforts were over. As you can see, that is a beautiful big rusty buck. So, under there it is completely rock hard. This thing is going to be as full as, and I can't wait to eat it. Alright, so while the fire's burning down out there, I've got another big roaring fire, as far as they are. While it's boiling out, we get a crab out. And I've got a nice little table to work on. And I'm going to cook this crab in aluminium foil. So he just cooks his own juices, I've got a little bit of salt water in it. So right there, just go down and wash it. Need to give our crab a bit of a wash, he's all covered in mud. Get as much mud off as we can so that it doesn't taint the meat. And toadfish trying to bite my foot. There we go. So you got the mud crab now, and we'll put him in the alfoil pocket. I've never done this before, so it's all, all a new thing. Now I'm gonna make it work. So we'll um we'll pull him off the coals now. I hope. Ow, that's hot. Put that there so it doesn't blow away. Oh, and it smells amazing. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! Yummy, yummy mud crab. Ow, that's hot. That's all shit. Ow. That looks amazing. So we're gonna run that out down to the water. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, that's hot. Ow, ow, I'm so hot. Oh yeah. Cool down, my friend. Ugh. Oh yeah. That's, that's all shit. You don't wanna eat that. Nor the gills, because they're poisonous. Alright, 
So we're gonna tuck into our crab now. It is hot, yeah. Ow! It's hot. <laughs> um. It's getting dark out there, so we're gonna have to hold the throttle and get back to the ramp before it gets dark. We didn't bring a phone or a torch or anything. Did we bring a phone? Yeah, I bring a phone. Oh no, we got a phone. It's heavy. That's a good sign. <laughs> oh, is there anything in here? Is there maybe one Christmas mud crab? Oh, one little crab. Only one. Whoa! Oh, Alright, we got one big buck. And a baby girl. One big boy and one little girl. Alright, so. We got a feed there. He's going on the fire shortly. I'm gonna head back to the beach after a bit and cook up. That's spot number four. Whoa! Nice! So we got two good bucks there and we got one in the bucket already. Doing alright. That one's definitely size. We'll measure this one. See how we go. Looking good. Alright, mummy pulling up some Christmas crabs. Hopefully. Anything? Four crabs. Four crabs. Any crabs? Oh, big eel. Pick it up. Can you see it, Isla? That's called an eel. A eel? Yep, they're yucky. So that crab's blue and white, his shell's thin, he's going to be half empty and he's nice and solid, he's brown, tan, he's full of meat, so that's the pick. Alright, we'll get the fire going, get some hot coals and we'll throw them on, beauty. You kill them like that, just straight them. in. Yeah, just cut straight in there and straight up towards there. The tip, tip of the knife, right there. Yeah, you right just in. Cut in, and you can just give it a wiggle. See, all the main stuff's right here, so if you can cut in up there. That's So how long do you leave them on the fire for? Do that for about 15 minutes. Give them a turn. Hey Pete. Right. Alright, cooking the crabs, got the family over there. Good little Chrissy. Give them about 15 minutes and then we'll be into them.